I'm Jennifer, a 16-year-old currently living in Seoul, Korea. It's my second time doing Focus in Youth, and I'm so excited to present you this very dynamic program, starting with the first movement of the Mozart Piano Sonata K332 in F major. Many of you may know this piece as one of Mozart's most well-known pieces. I love the piece since the bright, uplifting nature makes it lovely to listen to. I had a fun time incorporating the harp's beautiful tone and resonance to create a unique twist to the Mozart Sonata. But aside from the fact that I love his works and this sonata in particular, I chose this as a new challenge. During the difficult times of the COVID pandemic, with performances and competitions at a standstill, I decided to change my approach and incorporate pieces that I've never even thought of incorporating before in my repertoire. Playing music composed for other instruments allows me to bridge audiences outside of the harp realm and give a new light and splash a new color to music people are so used to listening to. The second piece is a classic, the Le Jean by Henri Regnier. For me, Le Jean is one of the pieces that I really take to heart. Any harpist or musician may empathize with this feeling, the feeling of listening to a piece for the first time and absolutely falling in love with it. That for me was Le Jean. The piece is based on the poem Le Zelf by the French poet Le Comte de Lille, telling a tragic tale of a knight riding through the forest at dark, cursed to death together with his be beloved by the cruel queen of elves. I think Henri Rene does an amazing job explicitly sculpting the storyline in detail through her musical language. From the rushing hooves of the horse to the romantic reminiscing of the knight's lover, the emotions and scenes are well manifested throughout the piece, which is its charm. I also think Le Jean stuck out to me due to the stark contrast the nature of the piece had with the stereotypical angelic image usually associated with the harp. Juxtaposed to this angelic image, Rene does not hesitate to display violence and darkness, which I personally think is great. Built by the diverse techniques, colors, and a very different facet of the harp, Le Jean magnifies the scope of the harp and the harpist's personality. So, all in all, I hope you enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. 